My name is Sarah Weiser and I am here in India reporting to you on a grant from the Pulitzer Center for Crisis Reporting. I'm working with Retro Report to produce a short news documentary and photo project that will be looking at population related issues today. Part of what we'll be doing is looking at this history of fears of overpopulation that growing populations would outstrip available resources and, and population control measures would be needed. That idea really informed a lot of population programs on the ground. And India was the first country in the world to adopt an official family planning program and that program developed into a stricter target-based program where health workers really at every level were given all sorts of sterilization targets they had to meet. Today, areas in the north are still struggling with higher fertility and people seem to still be very concerned about population numbers. We'll be going to Bihar, where fertility rates are higher than elsewhere in India, and looking at why that is. The area has much lower levels of literacy, health infrastructure is less developed, roads are less developed, electricity is less widespread. Areas in the south, meanwhile, have much lower levels of fertility and we'll be looking at some of the reasons maybe why. Well, education rates are higher, literacy rates are higher, infant mortality rates are lower and have been lower for a long period of time. Maternal health is better. Health infrastructure is better developed. Hospitals are better equipped and better staffed. Urbanization is relatively high. TV ownership is high and we'll be looking at why owning a TV might impact fertility rates. So some of the questions we're hoping to explore here is how different regions have approached population in different ways. Do we necessarily need to focus on population control or can we focus on something else? I am excited to see what this trip brings.